global trade creates a big opportunity and bigger challenges. A streamlined supply chain is vital for smooth flow of goods. The Make in India initiative launched by the Prime Minister Mr. Modi encourages multinational and national companies to manufacture their products in India. Logistics as a sector play a critical role in defining the domestic and international competitiveness of the Indian economy. Cargo logistics currently face lots of challenges. Every stakeholder manages their operations and information independently. This lack of streamlining leads to reduced workforce planning, eventually causing delays in the container movement. Besides the physical infrastructure, a strong IT solution is indispensable. The need of R is more than first mile or last mile connectivity or tracking of containers. It is needed for the entire logistics chain from the point of origin to destination. Delhi Mumbai Industrial Corridor Trust and Japanese IT major NEC Corporation collaborated to form DMI CDC Logistics Data Services Limited, which provides an end to end tracking system of container movement across all ports to the inland container depots, container freight stations, and end users via toll plazas and railway movement on an integrated basis. DMI CDC Logistics Data Services Limited was formed with the objective of leveraging ICT technology that can help in streamlining the entire logistics sector, which can bring in efficiency and transparency into the container movement and help in informed decision making by each of the stakeholders which are using this system. When this issue of uh, how do we improve the logistic uh, efficiency, uh, DMICDC was asked to facilitate you know, with the Japanese uh, companies and this is how DMICDC got involved into this system along with NEC of Japan and uh, we were able to develop this system. NEC policy is advanced know-how of logistics in the ICT field. Along with its Indian partner, NEC e Technology India, I worked closely with all the ministries. To enable near real-time tracking, a magnetic RFID or radio frequency identification tag is attached to the container. Every time it passes through a toll plaza, the container movement is recorded by the RFID reader and shared with LDB system until it reaches the inland container depot or container freight station. Anyone can check the container status and location online by just entering the container number at the portal. Any delays are identified and alert notifications are sent to the user. And in case any support is required, help desk can be reached via telephone, website and email. As a manufacturing company, we are totally dependent on custom house agent and various external agencies to know the whereabouts of our container. Having an portal, this helps me in integrated view across the supply chain, eases up my task of contacting multiple parties. All stakeholders can assess comparative performance, identify inefficiencies and bottlenecks to develop strategies and ensure the development of the sector. Under ease of doing business, uh, one key initiative is to reduce transaction cost and time. And Logistic Data Bank can become a game changer in creating that kind of transparency, visibility and accountability in the entire logistic chain. On 1st July 2016, India's busiest container port, the Jawaharlal Nehru port, initiated to implement logistics data tagging of containers in the country, covering all four of its existing terminals and its spreading its wing span India. The real value of the project lies in the business intelligence and analytics through the enormous historical data, which will be generated by the LDB system. It helps the logistics sector to know various bottlenecks and performance indicators to help streamline the operations of different entities in this sector. DMI CDC Logistics Data Services is committed to change the way logistics sector works in India. DMI CDC Logistics Data Services. Logistics redefined.